Hey guys, it's Rachel. Let's just ignore the fact that I look a hot mess right now and that the lighting may not be the best, but I'm here to do my 15th week pregnancy update. I'm 15 weeks and 6 days today, so in a few hours I will be 16 weeks. Honestly, you guys, this pregnancy is going by so fast. I think because I'm so busy, always on a go, I never really have time to sit and just really focus on the fact that I'm pregnant and that I'm carrying another life. It's crazy because every time I turn around, it's like, oh, I'm in another week but I love it I'm happy it's moving by quickly however I do wish I can like really enjoy it and stuff but um you guys in five months he'll be here this week has been a really crazy for me this has been the week of discharge you guys pre-pregnancy never really experienced discharge I had it here and there like before period after period a little bit that's it this time it's like crazy I woke up one night and I honestly thought I peed on myself come to realize it was discharge and since then I've been changing my underwear uh, two to three times a day F invested in some penny liners has been a lifesaver and some pads so I've been using that um that way I don't have to keep on you know doing laundry with the amount of uh, underwear I'm going through but it's insane how much I'm having discharge right now so yes that's been my biggest symptom this week also this week I've been really constipated I've experienced it last week as well but this week has been really really bad for me um I feel like every single time I have to go it's a process for it to come out it's just it doesn't just flow it's like you know I'm constipated so that's something else I've been dealing with this week and um, I've been drinking a lot of water and eating a lot more greens to try to help it a little better but um yeah still a little constipated also been experiencing a little bit of a stuffy nose I heard that kind of happens um in the 15th week so I wasn't really too worried but I have been experiencing a stuffy nose mainly when I wake up in the morning it's really really stuffy and then throughout the day it'll calm down but always in the morning when I wake up I'm stuffy and I don't know why I don't sleep with the fan on it's not like I'm cold so <laughs> hey I don't know but it's been happening for a few days I went to my doctor's appointment today it was kind of crazy because I mentioned that my doctor's appointment is in West Palm Beach I live in Orlando so it's a three hour difference for me so uh, to get there and come back is kind of crazy especially for one appointment so I literally um had my boyfriend drive me there for this appointment the appointment was like you guys 15 minutes like a 15 minute appointment three hour drive and then I came back this uh this morning so oh gosh it was intense you guys but um you know it needed to happen you know I want to keep up with these appointments and a lot of people's been asking me you know why don't I have my appointments in Orlando sorry guys um a lot of people has been asking me why I don't have my appointments in Orlando and it's because I'm delivering in West Palm I'm moving back to West Palm in April I graduate in May and I move back officially April 28th so it makes no sense for me to have my doctor here when I'm just gonna have to end up switching it again and I want to kind of grow with my doctor and my midwife and stuff especially since they're the ones that's going to be most likely delivering me so I want that bond that's why I make the sacrifice but it is really intense for me. I've also gained a few pounds. I don't know if you could tell in my face. If you've been watching me for a while, especially on my main channel. Um, I don't know if you could tell, but uh, my family can definitely tell that I've gained weight. My face is getting a little bit chubbier and my, uh, and my, um, my thighs. When I went to my doctor's appointment, they said everything was normal. They said my weight gain was normal. In total, I gained 12 pounds. So, um, I mean... <laughs> It is what it is. I'm not really focusing on the weight aspect. This week, um, I've also been experiencing a lot of aching. I went to two theme parks for my birthday, and I came to realize that um, I can't really do too much walking anymore. Um, like, I was walking a, a lot around school and stuff like that, and just trying to get that exercise aspect in, because I heard it really helps. But um, I find myself getting tired really easily, so if I stand up for too long, my legs will start to hurt, and I'll end up limping. Or if I walk long distances for a while, my legs will really, really hurt. Um, I'm having really bad leg pain, actually, on my left leg, really bad leg cramping. And I think it's because I've been walking so much. Um, now it's just like I feel like it's just pretty much damaged so um, I don't know what to do at this point I've also been experiencing slight back pain so uh, definitely some ba uh, back aches and I think I'm gonna invest in a pregnancy pillow I've mentioned that I was thinking about investing in one pr uh, before but I kind of held off on it because I'm like oh I'm not that far along um, 
but I think I'm going to go ahead and invest in it. My sleep has been getting a little better, but I haven't been really getting that much sleep, uh, to be quite honest with you. I get up a lot to use the bathroom, and then at the same time, I get up a lot because I feel wet down there because, of course, the discharge, like I mentioned, and then now I'm having leg cramps. So sometimes in the middle of the night, um, I have really bad leg cramps, and it's just like, ugh. <laughs> so um, I've been trying to stretch a lot more, but um yeah i'm trying to take it easy on the walking i'm not walking as fast anymore and i'm just trying to slow it down just because uh yeah like i said i find myself getting tired easily and limping after a while if i stand too long or walk too long so I'm trying to just tone it down and rest a lot more because like i said i have been on the go and then the um other symptom that i've been experiencing this week and this one kind of worried me so i definitely talked to my doctor about it but she said it was normal um remember when i told you guys i was using the bathroom a lot well now it, it kind of got better like i don't use the bathroom as often however like when i'm walking i feel like i have to pee so i'll go to the bathroom but nothing comes out but like every time i like when i'm sitting down i I'm fine but when I get up and I start walking I feel like I really really have to pee and I'm like oh my gosh like I hate it um but I spoke to my doctor about it and she said that I was completely normal she said um I pretty much forgot but like there's gonna be I'm gonna feel that pressure on my uterus and everything like that uh, because the baby's kind of right there right now like he's laying literally right on my uterus but um she said once i'm like 20 weeks i should he should lift up or something like that so um she said that's completely normal and then this week has been the best week for me because i've actually been feeling him move a lot so she told me that it's not kick it's not kicks it's fluttering or quickening is what they call it and pretty much she's just doing flips in my stomach and oh my gosh i feel it non-stop now and i love it love it love it love it love it because at first i didn't know if it was him actually moving like i assumed it was um but it's definitely him it feels like i don't know how to describe it it feels like popcorn popping inside your stomach or something like it's i don't know how to describe it but i feel him moving a lot um i know where he is he's laying right here um when I went to the theme parks and I was like walking a lot and stuff he was definitely going crazy in there like all the noise and stuff was making him move so it was crazy and he's also right now the size of an avocado so he's just he's getting so big um so yeah my camera's actually about to die right now so I'm gonna go ahead and show you my belly really fast um here's how I'm looking in the front the side and the other side so thanks so much for watching my video i'm so sorry if i talked really fast like i said my camera's about to die probably right this second so until next time i'll see you later i'll be making my 16 update 16 week update really really soon so look out for that and again sorry i look crazy bye guys